Hello guys and ladies, this is Premium Milk. Here is the tutorial for the Kinetic Transitions Pack for After Effects and Premiere Pro. On the zip file you will find the IP file for After Effects that contains all the Kinetic Transitions. There is also a ZXP file, the Premium Builder extension tool. You are able to install it on your system for After Effects and Premiere Pro. Here you will follow the instructions how to install it. Actually, you, you download the ZXP installer you just, and you just drag and drop this ZXP file here and it will install automatically to your system. So after you go to Window, Extensions and you will find Premium Builder Kinetic Transitions Pack here and here it is with uh, more than 100 for now and Kinetic Transitions. Let's see now how we customize these transitions and how we drop them to our project here we have i have four sequence 4k hd mobile and square so let's go to the hd uh, to the 4k version here we have these two fit two footages to these two footage and we want to bring a transition here so we select which one we want let's say we want this one double click and it will appear here. Make sure you put the, this transition marker in the middle. So here is the transition. By clicking, by clicking the U two times, it will bring the session properties. So here you are able to scale down and up the title. You are able also to edit the text from here if you want directly. So let's say hello. And of course you are able to change the colors to put two new colors for the background and the color here and you are also able to reduce and remove the black ba background of the transition to have only the title like this otherwise you have it 100% like this so the, the sound effects is included and if you, are able, if you want to, to, to put it more than one second just right click time, time stretch 200 and you have this transition on two seconds if you want so this is the way that works let's go to the mobile version to see how we customize on a mobile let's say we want uh, this effect double click here as you can see here first of all you have to scale all the transition to fit the screen and after you are able to reduce the scale of the text as much as you want okay so here this is our transition very nice and of course you are able to get inside here the transition and find inside the, pre the precom the text placeholder to change the text and write down your own text and after from here you are able to scale and position the text how you want if something is, is wrong. You have full customization for these uh, titles. So this is, you can choose from 100 transitions here very nice and drag it to your project and any sequence even 8K. And let's go now to Premiere Pro how to do, how to customize here. Almost the same things here on the extension you find the Premium Builder Kinetic Transitions Pack and let's go to the HD version and bring a transition like this one. When you double click to bring a transition please lock this line that you have your footage in order this to come above your this uh, layer. Just wait some second. Okay and here here we don't unfortunately we don't have a marker but we know it is in the middle and here you're able from the Cessia graphics panel to reduce again the scale of the title if you don't want the background you can reduce it from here and you have the transition ready you have to render to see the result and from here you can change also the color of the text and the color of the other of the background you can change the font, the title, everything. And here, of course, you are able also to change the speed 
of the the speed here of the transition let's go to two, two seconds and click here maintain audio pitch in order to have a better result for your, for the audio very nice this is the effect let's go to another let's go to a mobile to see this one let's find another one let's bring to this one this is what's next let's lock and bring and bring this Remember that by the time you bring it from the Cessia graphics, you are able to scale down the title and also to scale a bit the transition if you want from here. It's a little bit tricky, you will find the way. Let's find another one like uh, these bubbles of yes let's delete the old one and bring here here the sensor graphics reduce and change let's say to high okay and let's see the result you can render to see the result let's render it to see how fast it is for one second or two for the transition. Depending for the effect of the transition, it takes more than 10 seconds. Okay. Very nice. Remember that you are able to change the colors and to put off the background all the time for every transitions of this 100 that uh, I made for you. So this is it how it works. I hope uh, you like the transition for After Effects and Premiere Pro. I hope it will be more than 100 with the next update. Thank you very much. Bye bye.